Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is Andy for Unboxing. Uh, it's not a long time since I last unboxed. Uh, it was day before yesterday. But today's an exciting day because... Susie missed her cue. Snack surprise, yes. Now, we've got, um, it, it's December. We paid for, it's December the, what day is it, third. Um, we paid for this on November the 1st or 2nd, somewhere around there. And it's just arrived. They <coughs> promised us that the December box will be here by the 14th, 15th. All right, they're taking their time. Anyway, being as it's like almost a Christmas box, um, Susie's got an idea of where it's from. Lapland. Lapland. Father Christmas. Father you ever heard of Lapland? Christmas. Snacks? Candy canes? Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, here's a question for you, Susie. Who would likely take over Father Christmas's role of delivering the presents if Father Christmas was ill? Easter Bunny is the obvious answer because he knows the route. Anyway, I'm going to open it up without more ado. Uh, trusty screwdriver. Let's find out where it's coming from. Trusty screwdriver's pants now. Never mind. Anyway. I'm just going to send my sister's clothes. Here we go. Open it upside down. Right, are you ready? Where do you think it's from? Suspense is killing you, I know. It is Schweden. All right, so we're going to have lots of potatoes. Ooh. That was a bit racist. Anyway, so let's see what we get first of all. Cheese balls. All right. A big packet of cheese balls. Yeah. This is a big. They're all right, you know. I don't. No, 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 cheese balls are all right. They're just. They're just like half a what's it? Yeah. So anyway, we've got cheese balls. We've got Dylan Glashlach crisps. I have no idea what that means, but okay, we'll try them. We'll give them a go. You want to go? Yeah, go on. You can open them. All right, we got the drink. Let's have a look at the drink, shall we? It's... Seriously, Susie, this is not any... This is no information to you guys whatsoever. All right, and the reason is... I have no idea what that is. Helen Soda. Yeah, I can see it's soda. Any more? Helen. Strawberry? Cherry? Oh, all. Oh, Cranberry? Uh, anyway... Uh, what else we got? There's actually not as much as there usually is in this box. So obviously, oh, these look amazing. Oh, <laughs> um, for some reason, it's just not as full as it usually is. Um, these are mums, mums, mum, mums. And I've got to be honest, looking at them, they look oh, mum, num, 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 num. They look really delicious. And if the Swedish could do it as well as last month's box and the Austrians, these are going to be amazing. Because mm. I'll tell you what, that was an incredible box. My mum's... Let's stand over here. You ain't getting your hands on them. <laughs> Let's All right. These are poly zoos. These are zoo bananas and milk, milk chocolate. They, they look like marshmallowy sort of things. I'll try and give them a go. All right, and for all you Swedes out there, please send me a message as to, you know, what this drink is, because we really haven't got a clue. Not until I drink it. All right, okay, we've got some, uh, uh, got a blender. They look like kind of Harry Bow. All right, they're jellies. Yeah, agreed? agreed? Yeah. They go over my side. Yeah. Here's one for Susie. It's a cheese and chive sandwich oh. wafer bag. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Susie has a thing about chives. <laughs> Don't know what it is, but it's chives. Is chives is Susie. Right, we have... Oh, God, she's going to grab these as well. These are called lin chips. All right? And you've got to be careful how you say that. Lin chips. She's eating it already, for God's sake. All right? Um, that's basically rye vita with cream cheese mm. and chives. Okay, she likes them. Um, these are onion and chive as well. Ooh. Yeah, they're gone. Okay. All right. This is more me. Mm. Tarragona. All right, this is chocolate and hazelnut. 
so effectively a big Nutella bar. <laughs> uh, what have we got here? It doesn't take much, but that actually looks like French nugget. Does that look like French nugget to you? French nougat? Oh no, I did Spanish and well. <laughs> Thanks for all your help, Susie. You've been flag. invaluable, baby. <laughs> the flag. <laughs> oh, I love this woman so much. <laughs> We've got a packet of crisps, which I've got no clue. Oh, give us a try of that. Is this that cheap cheese and chives thing? Mm. Amazing. That's dry. Oh, God. Very, very dry. <laughs> um, yeah, no idea what these are. We'll find out. Very dry. Mm. Come back to me. <laughs> anyway, then we have these uh, like little marshmallow things. These are called um, Bila. Bila, Bila. Mm. Al what does that say? Aldrens. It sounds like allergens. It is it's actually an anagram of allergens. All right. She's checking. It's not. Okay, it's close enough. Anyway. <laughs> then we have some more Zoo Originals. These look like the jelly lips. Used to get if you was ever a child in England, so we used to get a jelly lips, which were really nice. But these are actually a bit harder, so they're more like her um, wine gums, uh, fruit gums, that yeah, sort of thing. And it was quite hard to chew. These are, yeah, they're very firm. What else we got? There's actually still quite a bit in here. Cool Cola Scally. Yeah, I do keep saying, stop trying to do the accent. <laughs> Please, my Swedish really friends. Really very good. <laughs> Send me a return video saying, Andy, you're stupid. This is said so. This is a, a scale. All right. I have no idea what that is. Jellies. They're like cola bottles. They're jellies. They're cola bottles. Cola cubes or cola bottles. Mm -hmm. But I think they're... Octopus. I have no idea. What, you say it's an octopus. Is that an octopus? Yeah, I thought octopus at first. I'm not sure what it is. Um. Okay. This is a marabou pickle. It, it is. It's a cola flavored wine gum. It says there. Okay, it says it. In, it's in English on the back. Uh, pickle. So, do you want to fancy a pickle? Oh, it's got wafer, isn't it? Oh, yeah, okay. you have that. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. Oh, there, we've got to eat this by the 19th for the 11th. first. Short dated. Um, that, you cannot see as such. I have no idea what that even says. Power bowl, power, power bowl. But, it's like some kind of like big chocolate. Mush marshmallow, marshmallow? Oh, I have no it's idea if it, it is you're not getting it, oh. it. <laughs> I was only going to squeeze you're not it. getting it I don't want it alright Kex I don't know what that is that's a wafer so that's definitely a Susie thing she likes a wafer it is a wafer more nugget it's called double nugget and literally that's the best spelling of double ever <laughs> double <laughs> oh. that's the cockney way to spell it I've got two of these. These are called original sandwiches. These are tiny little things, but yeah. But it's a sandwich, so where does it go? She's still eating them. They're dry. Okay. All right, I'll have that. And it doesn't take a rocket scientist to work out that that's basically a dime bar. One of the mini dimes. Dumme. <laughs> I could try it and try it. Well, I, I've got to be honest, I don't have a fake Swedish accent, so I can't really, yeah. Let's try it, see what it's like. That's not a dime bar. <laughs> that is actually really nice. My, my that is, um, that is a very creamy caramel wrapped in chocolate. 
that I'm going to be chewing for the next two or three hours. Um, it's not bad at all. Good box. I'm opening the other one. It was really nice. Um, good box. I'm still chewing the old one. I don't know. Was it a good box, Boozy? Yeah, not as much as normal. No, it's not as much in it as normal, but, no, you know, it's difficult in Europe at the moment getting supply, especially from all over. Um, and, you know, snack surprise. Um, oh, man, I'm going to be eating this for a week. Um, I love these. A snack surprise. It's a difficult job. It was a great idea, but it's difficult because unless you've got absolutely ton loads of, of uh, cash flow, and like, for example, it's now December. They should be working on March. Um, unless you've got the cash flow to do that, it's almost impossible. So um, I wish them luck. I hope they do really well. Because this is our fourth box. Is it a fourth, fifth? <coughs> I think it's Austria, fifth. Turkey, Greece. It's fifth. Austria, Turkey, Greece. Four, four boxes. This is our fourth box. Okay. And I've got to be honest, they're all a lot of fun. Um, if you ever stop chewing, all right, they're actually quite delicious. I just had to swallow it whole. All right, um, yeah. So look out for snacksurprise.co.uk, I'm assuming, because I can't remember. Snacksurprise.com. On the bottom of the box. All right, there's the Facebook, the Twitter, and the Instagram there. All right, um, go on there, because they are offering some really good deals at the moment. Um, I do believe the November box is all sold out. Hardly surprising. I think we got a message on the second or third saying it had all gone. Um, but there is still December available. That came up today. Um, definitely go on it. Snacksurprise.com. And uh, guess what day it is tomorrow? It's the best day of the month. It's a gin day by any It's chance. gin day. That means my Craft Gin Club box is coming tomorrow. Um, I am actually working tomorrow night DJing. Um, but I will try and get the gym box uh, video done in the afternoon because, you know, I've done, I think it's 17 videos now on the Craft Gym one for November was the second most popular one I've had. So, um, yeah, definitely. Thanks, Rocket. Welcome. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I love this cat. All right, no worries. Have a good night, guys, and I'll see you again soon.